We're talking with Jeff Garzik, the co-founder of Block and Metronome, as well as a core developer of Bitcoin. And speaking of, of uh, proceeds, I was curious, after the token launch, how will future development of Metronome be funded? Now, that's a great question. And it's uh, like, like everything else in Metronome, it's a bit complicated. Yeah. Because, uh, traditionally, uh, the sort of the easy ICO route, which we are not taking, is uh, that there is a person who uh, manages some funds and they dole out developer bounties and marketing bounties and uh, things of that nature incentivized in that token. What we're trying to do is we're trying to build a cryptocurrency. And uh, Bitcoin, when Bitcoin was launched, there was uh, no uh, Satoshi Funds developer's picture. It was launched and it was expected that businesses would build around Bitcoin as they did. Similarly, when Litecoin was launched, there was no uh, question of who is going to fund Litecoin development, who is going to build Litecoin. It was simply, let's launch the best cryptocurrency and build a community around it. And so that's really the goal with Metronome, and that's how you get a cryptocurrency to be truly that top 10 uh, cryptocurrency in terms of popularity, market cap, et cetera, is that uh, you really want to encourage others to build on top of Metronome. And so that's the sort of two, three, four chess move down the road thinking that we're trying to engage. And so uh, the short answer is, is that uh, we are doing some Metronome development ourselves. Uh, we're building a Metronome mining pool, which is uh, the world's first ERC-20 mining pool, very, very unique. Uh, we're going to have a metronome wallet. We're going to have developer SDKs and libraries available at launch. So uh, we're uh, absolutely sponsoring a lot of development ourselves. But again, we don't want people to depend on that. If we're building a currency for the next 100 years, we have to build a currency that doesn't go away if I go away or block goes away. Um, we got to build a currency where uh, stealing a phrase from open source, there's no vendor lock-in. And so we call that the centralized to decentralized flight path is you incubate, uh, one company kicks off a decentralized network, but you got to have that leave the nest flight path. You got to have a uh, point at which you release control and you give it to the community and you let the community build around metronome. And that's really what we're trying to incentivize, think about, and uh, construct here. Right on. Perfect.